so as you can see I had the toddler already I am so excited guys she's so beautiful I love her um, but I do have a little story to tell about her so I was expecting her and she did come when I was supposed to get her but the box she came in was horrible it was so destroyed it was just disgusting it was all taped up all bent up and for the address she just put like a regular piece of paper and just wrote my address on it and she didn't even put my name in it so the post guy just didn't know if he should have gave it to me because he's like they usually need a name for the signature and so he let it slide he's like you know what it's not your fault it's the person who sent it fault I'll just give you I'll just let you sign whatever name so I signed my name and I was really upset because it was like kind of like a big deal and then I took her inside and I opened her immediately because I was afraid she was going to be damaged. Um, she was, the box was so damaged that the uh, post guy, um, the USPS guy was like, you know what, if you don't want to accept uh, this package, I could just return it back to the seller so they can give you the, the money because the box looks pretty damaged. I was like, oh, I'll just take my chances. I'll just, you know, I'll return it if I really, if what's in there it's really damaged and he's like all right so i took the box all damaged it looks small too um in my room i opened it up and she was just thrown in there just thrown in there like you know a very inexpensive object that was just bought off just random sites just thrown in there and it really hurt my feelings at first I was so worried that she was damaged um I checked her over and I did find a little bit of damage or so I thought and um it was actually like little black ink from the box or the box has writing on it so it was like a Home Depot box or whatever and some of the ink rubbed off on her and I thought I wouldn't be able to get it out but I grabbed a little towel and I uh gently rubbed it and it immediately came off like if nothing happened so I was so glad about that and I I was just having a hard time rebonding with her because of that situation so I was thinking about it but then I looked her over I couldn't have to fall in love I just wanted to ignore all the bad things that happened because she's just so lovely and so yeah here she is her name's Emilia Marie um I was thinking of naming her Madison instead but I think we'll stick with Amelia Marie, and if I decide to change it to Madison, I will change it to Madison. Because she looks like a Madison to me. But, yeah, here she is, a little close-up of her. She has beautiful blue eyes, which I actually am thinking about changing into, like, a, a light brown or a dark brown eyes just to give her that puppy-eyed effect, and I think it'll complement her brown hair very nicely. But I'm still thinking about that. Maybe I'll just keep the blue. I don't know. She's just so lovely, guys, and I just adore this little lady. She's just so pretty. Her hair is very nicely rooted, and that noise is her uh, joints. <laughs> so she has joints in her head, as you can see, or here. And she has a, a torso right here that ends right here, so she could wear, like, cute little dresses. Um... But, yeah, that's her and then I'm Marie. Um, I will do a details video later. I just came to show you guys, and I hope you guys really like her. Uh, I don't know what she's going to be for Halloween yet. Um, I think I have some outfits for her, but I'm not sure. So, I, can, I like to put her head kind of like the side, like that, because it looks like she's kind of like curious. But yeah, I will be doing more videos with her. I actually have a Yumi's morning routine because um, I got that voted on Instagram. But I don't know how to edit it. So I'm going to have to redo it. And now I'm going to try to edit things through my phone. So anywho, she is lovely wearing this lovely little dress I had for my other toddler when I used to have another toddler. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't. Make sure to comment down below. Uh, comment what is your favorite thing about this Reborn community. I would love to know that. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Mwah.